So is Boucheron actually legitimately slept on? So some people actually do run Boucheron and find him to be a good unit, and he does have some unique things about him that could make him quite strong. For example, he has high build, high build growth, good, like decent speed and decent speed growth. Now obviously he's gonna be missing some speed on Axe Fighter, but he has pretty good speed and build growth. And his strength growth is only 20%, but if you throw him on something like Wyvern, that could completely fix him. In early game, he's actually not bad because you can just push him forward and he can enemy phase pretty well. So like right now, I can probably just like override these dudes, just get a kill here. So enemy phase these dudes on Axe, override them, kill them. He can just kind of push out on his own. He legitimately is pretty strong early on. So it's very likely the case that if you throw him on Wyvern, it actually completely fixes him and makes him very strong as well. So it's Bushin time, everyone. All right, let's see what he can do. We have him on Sigurd. He has momentum. Now with the hero's axe, he's going to be hitting pretty hard. So let's check this out. Let's see what kind of numbers we're looking at. Those are some numbers. The, those there are some numbers. <laughs> My dude is one-shotting a guy. <laughs> All right, maybe he actually has potential. Maybe he has, maybe he has the potential that no one knew except for the people that run him. Maybe he is really good and maybe it should be Bushin time. Now let's say we want an override because that's a thing he can do. How much can he one shot these? He can one shot them on Axe. He can almost one shot them with override. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. I think this will be part of the metagame for this map. Yeah, look at that. How many kills is that? Let's see. All right, one, two, three, four, <laughs> five, six kills. <laughs> All right, now a lot of units can achieve this, like Chloe can kind of do this, um, Louis can kind of do that, but that's pretty crazy. <laughs> it's pretty silly. It has been said that if you give Boucheron Sigurd, it's Bouchon time. And if you look at this result here, he can just walk up to this man with an axe and just axe him a question. Look at that. Who needs archers? So in Chapter 7, he seems to be kind of like the Grim Reaper right now. He's just kind of like floating around the map. He can one-shot horses with the Rider's Bane. He can one-shot like mages and archers with Noatun. So he's doing okay. So yeah, we'll see how this pans out long term. It's finally come down to this. The Wyvern Boosh has been created. All right, so let's see what he can do on chapter eight here. Or I'm sorry, chapter nine. We can save Jade. This is actually kind of decent, I'm not gonna lie. This is pretty solid. But you might need crits too. Dude, it's Boosh in time. It's always Boosh in time. He immediately crits that dude. Now you can armor slayer these and it's like very similar. So the hammer, you know, questionable, but he has the build. Right now his build is 12, that's with Sigurd, so he's at 10. But as he levels up, he should be able to wield things like hammer. He could also run Brave Axe and Quad. So I think that's probably gonna be the build, like a Brave Axe Quad and then Noatan Doubler. And then he could situationally run like hammer without it slowing him down, making use of his speed and his build. So we'll see how this pans out. I'm gonna be doing a bunch of different build tests on this particular run. I don't want to spoil any of them, so let's try to hide. Let's try to hide those units over there. Uh, that's pretty much it for this one. Definitely like and subscribe if you enjoyed this. Uh, feel free to become a channel member if you want. There is a unique icon you get next to your name when on the channel, on live stream and when commenting. Also, you get access to the cool emotes that you might see in live stream or comments. Oh uh, yeah, that's it for this one. Peace.